Okay, you guys. So I took another break. Um, I'm not gonna check the mail right now because uh, this one isn't moving out no time soon. I mean, she just got to high school. She got C. Like, eh. when she wake up, we'll see. But she's so exhausted. I'm not worried about. It. What I am worried about is Charlotte having these pink babies. I waited long enough. I've waited long enough. I don't want to wait any longer. I don't want to wait. We need to have these pink babies. So, <clears throat> we're going to start labor now. And I could have give birth right here in this house. I want her to go to the, um, the hospital, though. I want her to go to the hospital and have these pink babies. I hope she has four of them because... I, I, I set them up for, for quads, 100% chance of quads. She's been listening to children's music, watching children's TV. She has the um, fertility treatment, a lifetime reward, and she walked into the hospital. The hospital not far, though. Yeah, the, I, I put her right next door to the hospital because I knew she was going to love it there. She was going to be there a lot. <laughs> New phone, who this? I can't pick up right now. I'm in labor. My water broke all over the place. That's my daughter was calling. Oh, hey, Hannah. So let's see. Oh, my gosh, please let them. I hope at least, if she has four, at least two of the kids actually be pink. I don't want them to come out looking normal. And they're like, wait a minute, you supposed to be like a hot pink baby. I want hot pink babies. Is he coming to the hospital? I know he's in a relationship with another woman now, or Sharif. I think that's a woman. I know. Either way, I know he's in a relationship with somebody else. What? 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 The music's sad. What's happening? My daughter's asleep, so it nothing happened to her. The dog is playing ball. Whoa, whoa! You saw he flew up on a witch broom? Wait a minute. Why he look homeless? Why is he wearing a holy shirt? Anyway, I'm glad he's coming to the hospital. Um, I'm glad he's going to be here with me, even though, you know, we didn't work out. I took his virginity, I took his virginity and, and, and all that. But, yay, it's a boy. The first baby's a boy. Please, please, please. If it's not quads, let it be triplets, please. The first baby's a boy, and he's brave. Uh, that's a nice trait. Um... Now, because their father is the pink baby, I know his real name is Aaron and whatnot, but I don't care about that. He's pink baby. He will always be pink baby to me. So I'm going to name all these babies names starting with a P. So for the first boy, we're going to name him Peter. Okay? More. Oh, we got to do this first. Hey, outdoors. Come on. Yes, another one. Another one. He <laughs> pink. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm overjoyed. He's pink. He's pink. Cause I really thought like after all this time wishing, wanting, hoping, and praying and all that to have some pink babies with the pink baby that it would be such horrible karma if none of the babies came out with the father's skin tone. You know what I mean? So like, oh my god, it's another boy. Um, Peter. Uh we're gonna do Paul. Yeah, Peter Paul. <laughs> um Oh, okay, 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 that one didn't come out, that one came out quote-unquote normal, that's okay. Oh my gosh, there's another boy? Oh my god, I'm surrounded by boys. That's my nightmare. Listen, that's my nightmare in real life. Um, me and Undead Domain have already uh, agreed that we want three kids. I rather would only have one or two, he wants three, so I'm conceding we'll have three kids when the time is right, and he wants at least two boys and the one girl, and his biggest fear is having nothing but girls, because his sister has four girls, and my biggest fear is having nothing but boys, and I was like, what if we end up with three boys? He was like, oh, we would have to try for an, a girl then, after that. I'm like, what? <laughs> no, what? Well, <laughs> no, no, that's not how it works. Um, But, oh my gosh, yay! Uh, I hope this one turns out pink. And I hope that there is one more baby and that it's a girl. But anyways, though, so we have another boy. So we have Peter, 
We have Paul. I'm gonna do Parker. Oh my god, I should I should name the first one. Um, well, the second one. So Peter Parker. Um. So yeah, Parker. Now I'm, I'm kind of nervous to see this. Not, he's an artist and a loner. That those two traits make a lot of sense. Oh my god, there's another one. It's four, and it's a girl. It's a girl. It's a girl. Oh my god, yay! Oh, I'm gonna name her Penny. I kind of feel like there's a desperate housewife thing going on with all the peas, but that's not what's supposed to be. In fact, should I name her something besides Penny? Because Penny also is the dog from the 101 Dalmatians. I can, you know, I can't really think of any good P names. Like, because Pauline, that's too close to Paul. I guess Prue, Piper, um, Phoebe, that's another P name. I, I don't know, I don't want to use Phoebe. Um, and what was the other sister on Charmed? Uh, it was Prue, Piper, Phoebe. What, what, what was the other one? Because they had, there was four sisters. And, like, she was, like, kind of like the bastard baby because she was, like, half white lighter and half witch because her daddy was the mother's white lighter. Um, it was Prue. Prue was the oldest. Piper was the daughter that no one cared about who now is on Pretty Little Liars. Then it was um, Phoebe, which was the cool one. And then there was the other one, Rose McGowan. What's her name? And the other bitch. I don't know her name. Okay, well, you know what? I can't even think of any good P names. So I'm just going to go with Penny. I'm sorry. We're doing Penny. She's another one who likes music, but she's a slob. Okay. Okay, it was four. Two pink babies. Two pink babies. The girl was pink, too. Oh, my gosh. Yay, we got two pink babies. Yes, right. Take them home. Take them home. Take our pink babies home. Oh, my gosh. Look at that basket full of babies. Look at that basket full of babies. Look. It said, yowza. <laughs> Woo. Aaron Goff and Charlotte Humphreys had their work cut out for them with the addition of four. Oh yes we say four new babies introducing peter paul parker and penny yes yes but guess what we don't have our work cut out for us charlotte has her work cut out for her because daddy don't live with us well um we'll fill up the crib but you know we're gonna age them up as soon as possible right he came home with us. That's nice. Oh my gosh! Look, look. Let's let's really look at them. I don't know what color their eyes are though. Well, we won't really know what color their eyes are until um they turn into toddlers anyway because usually their eyes are just black in the middle. See, right now, even the whites of their eye is pink, and that's because you know babies don't really have like a real texture in the um sims 3 and every baby is beautiful is when they get to toddler they start looking funny but he has bright blue eyes so i don't know what the kid's eyes gonna come out is he gonna be like a blue or a green um but oh my gosh i can't believe we actually had the four and that two came out pink i'm glad that we didn't just try for one then because what the first one didn't come out pink that would have been terrible. Come on, you gotta take them out the baskets and um put them all away. Why that one just on the floor? I thought it was in the basket. Imagey. I wish you could have multiple children with the same guy. Like, well, different pregnancies, I mean. Not multiple children, but different pregnancies. Like, cause I would get pregnant by him again right now. Like, why wait? Why wait, you know? Um, also, now that, uh, we got, well, we still gotta put these babies away. Or at least take them out the basket, because come on, Charlotte. We got one more you need to take out the basket, and then we'll start, um, growing them up. Oh, Charlotte hungry. Well, Charlotte, you still got a baby in a basket, Charlotte. Oh, no, they just took the baby out, because they was getting tired of waiting. Um, tell him to leave now. Because he's not useful to us. We can't have children with him. He can't help us take care of the kids. Thank God we have one teenager to help us with these four. Even though we're going to grow them up soon. 
But now that um he's grown, we got to work on having a baby with other people. Now, this dude, we didn't have a baby with him. We should invite him over because we friends. I'm not even going to tell him to leave. He'll figure out when we invite the other dude over if he comes. Because I don't think I got kids with him. I'm, I'm going to check real quick because, you know, sometimes I forget who Charlotte does and does not have children with. I think his daddy dead. Rick, yeah, I think his dad, yeah, his daddy dead. Um, yeah, we had a baby by him too, but he dead. Um, I just, I just care about my kids. They put his kids in there. I don't care about all that. Um, I think their daddy dead too. That's Pappy Wolf. Yeah, he dead. Yep. Dang, some of my kids don't really don't actually have fathers. Their fathers are dead. Rainfall Ivy getting up there. He's next on the to be dead soon list. Um, Vampire Twin. His, his, their daddy gonna be alive pretty much forever. He's dating Alice. Ed, fake Edward is dating Alice. Okay. And they had a baby. Oh, the betrayal. Oh well, but um, Abby, who's who's your father? Wait a minute. Oh, no, that's your father. Wait, wait. Oh, never mind. I, I thought something incestuous went on. Never mind. Uh, Okay, that's your daddy. Gotta check, because I never know. Okay. Okay, so we haven't had children with this man yet. Um, His grandfather, grandmother. He was raised by his grandparents. He wasn't raised by his parents. I don't know. They're, they're talking about the baby. Like, these are my grandparents. His grandparents young. Anyway, so I've never had a baby with this man. So, yeah, let's tr try and see if we can get him over. Yeah, he's coming. He's coming over. Um, Charlotte, uh, dressing something sexy, Charlotte. Something um, pregnancy worthy. We didn't try for triplets. Yeah, put the baby away. Do that for me. Charlotte looks sexy. Just don't pass out, Charlotte, because that will ruin everything. Where is he at? Because I want to be, like, up in his face when he come. Like, hey, what's up? You you look nice today. Um, Are, are you very fertile? Oh, that's nice to know. I like that. Here he is. Oh, he's, he's another werewolf. But you know what? I do not care. Um... Let's invite him inside so he know you can come inside and then he can, um, never mind. I'm not going to finish this. <laughs> he may enter my house and then enter, never mind, never mind. Um, uh, get, get in here with me and try for babies with me. Try for a baby with me. Have a baby with me, baby. Well, he's invited inside. Now I just gotta get him into the shower with me. No, nope, there's no time for flowers or romance or none of that. Charlotte is too exhausted. Like, I'm just gonna be like, hey, listen. I'm hungry. I need to take a nap. But first, have this baby with me. Come on. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because you know what I like. That's right, put your children away. Look at them, the same complexion as you. Their tones weren't muted or anything, I love it. Oh yeah, let's let's get in the shower now. Make that baby. Come on, let's go. Follow me, please. Follow. Make a baby with me. I, I'm so happy and so proud of how well Charlotte takes the, the breakups in her relationships and all this kind of stuff and you know the fact that she's not actually whiffing on her baby fathers she just takes it all in stride and then she just keeps it moving oh it's not like they were getting violent in there um there we go oh he was happy for a second because he thought he was getting some more, but you're not getting any more, though. Um, I don't want to me be mean because technically we're not even in a romantic relationship with the guy, so he can't, like, accuse us of cheating on him or nothing like that. Um, you should just go to bed, Charlotte, because you're already exhausted. We'll age up the babies um, after she wake up. Oh, and Fat Mike, 
my daughter, because she's hungry. She needs to wake up anyway. Awaken Bone Hilda. And then she needs to eat something. And then she needs to go wash up. And then she needs to get on the computer. Yeah, we know you hungry. I'm, I'm sure you are, baby. But that ain't got nothing to do with me right now. Wake, wake up, bony bitches. Bony bitch coming out the coffin like, hey, that's a big mess for you to clean up. Trying to have fun, play hopscotch. It's not for you, though. Are you still here? Um, honey, my bad. But before you eat, can you tell all these people leave because they don't belong? Just, just put your food down real quick. I know he's having a good time with his baby, but he need to get out, though. But, but, um, he better pay child support for all of them. That's supposed to be $4,000 a day. Because you're supposed to pay child support every day. I know he won't, but it would be nice if he did. And then we'll get her on the computer to do her extra credit homework. That's right, leave. I'm like, oh, he didn't even get jealous neither. Um, Fantasy was kissing another dude for him. She, she, um, she did him in the room. They got, she got pregnant in the shower by him. <gasps> Bony, wait a minute. What the hell? Bone Hilda is human. Oh my gosh, y'all. Bone Hilda human. Bone Hilda's a person. And she has body yaddy yaddy. I mean, she's burnt to all hell and and stuff, but she's a person. Um, you can get Bone Hilda pregnant? Can and right now, my daughter can actually get pregnant by Bone Hilda with the mod. Um, can you build up a relationship with a Bone Hilda? Because like I said, I have the mod where, um, she can get pregnant by women. Like, so that, that just opens the dating pool up tremendously for the 100 Baby Challenge. But the fact is that, now I'm curious, can she get pregnant and more so, can Bone Hilda get pregnant and have babies? Okay, so this this has nothing to do with the challenge, okay? So we just gonna do this real quick. Oh, but you know what? If she gets if we get Bone Hilda pregnant, it's gonna count as Charlotte's baby. Even though it won't be inside. But um uh, okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We're we gonna do some cheating real quick. And, and this does not affect the challenge itself, but but I just want to see something, um, because I never knew, I knew that, um, that she act like a human. I didn't know she was human, though. Can you add her to your family? You can, see, the thing is, too, you can't add Bone Hilda to the family. But you can edit her and create a sin. Okay, I'm just gonna test something real quick then. Um, I, I'll turn off the cheats because now I don't need them since I can't add her to a household. I'm just gonna see what happens. Pregnancy option, get Bone Hilda pregnant. Sim has no lot, not enough room in household. Okay, okay, so you can't actually get a Bone Hilda pregnant. Because here's why I was like kind of like like, oh yes, yes. Because if Bo Hilda had a baby, and if the baby was a boy, because I can change it with the mod, she would have a little black baby. <laughs> Not African American, but an actual black baby. And then Charlotte could have some black babies. Um, You know, Charlotte needs to do that too. Charlotte needs to get the, the genie thing so she can have some blue babies. Uh, we'll work on that with her next um set of lifetime points. But dang, Bo Hilda, she crispied herself. Is she gonna go back into her hole? Cause she's like, I'm burnt now. I I'm not happy. Pineapples, it hurts. 
Is she going back? No, she's going to take a shower and clean up. She's going to clean up herself and then clean up the house, right? No, she's still cleaning. She's just like, I'm not fixing that no more. Um, But she has to. You have to fix up the house. But that was so interesting to find out that Bone Hilda was a human. I tell you, secret life of Bone Hilda. Things you never know about a bony bitch until you really spend time with her. So my daughter, my daughter got a man. Oh my God, that's nice to know. My son just got a new job as a cop. You go, baby. You go. I love hearing about my children. That's why I, I wanted the story progression mod so badly. Cause I wanna know what's happening with all my children since Starlet is gonna have so many. It's nice to know what's gonna happen to them. Toddlers are gonna be terrible. I, I, I'm not looking forward to having four toddlers at the same time again.